What's up scum crew? Welcome back to the vlog. Today we're going to the beach and we're gonna go chill and skim. I'm about to go meet up with Kinsey and Chris and then we're gonna head to the beach and catch some fat waves. There she is, look at that little monster. Rare Kinsey comes out of a natural habitat to enter the truck. There you go. <laughs> you like that? <laughs> Stop you weirdo. We finally just got to the beach. Time to go hit up the wave, see if the skim is good. It was good yesterday, but I didn't bring my camera. Of course I can't get any water shots because I lost my GoPro. Hey everyone, look at Kinsey way out there in the paddleboard. So Chris met with us here, but you didn't see that because Kinsey didn't get any footage of me and Chris skimboarding because she's a jerk. But now we're gonna head to the hot tub and chill. We're finally here at the hot tub. Now we're just gonna chill and have a little hot tub sesh. So that hot tub that we were just at is not like our hot tub. It's like a hotel hot tub that we always jump in. And usually most of the staff is really chill with us going there and they like us and they know us. But there was like a new guy there. And he's like, do you go to this hotel? And I was like, no. He's like, then get out. So now me and Kinsey are gonna go get a little bit of food. I'm waiting for a second because I kind of want to see him like walk by and I want to zoom the camera in on you on him and show you like this this guy All right, he's staying in his little hut. He's not coming out, but that guy's kind of a jerk <laughs> You freaking out? Freaking out freaking out. I think Are you good? Yep. This kid's thinking crazy It's a green light. Totally put a sticker on that sign. Whoever goes through that little turning signal thing, which is like the busiest part of our town, is gonna see the scump fam. That's where it's at. For dinner tonight, we're having scumpy. We're gonna have some scump tuna and some scump salad. And I'm gonna have Chick-fil-A. No one cares. I came home and it got dark really quick because the rain was like about to happen but it got as dark as the beginning of that time lapse when i got home i was just like oh it's gonna go blow something up but it was so dark and crappy it wouldn't look good on the camera so now i'm at home chilling i put out a message on my instagram which if you don't have me on instagram go down below and add me why do i have a gun i don't know i'm crazy go down to my instagram follow me on instagram and i asked people to send me in questions for q a so i'm eating some dinner and then we're gonna have a Q&A on all the questions that you guys sent to me. For dinner, I showed you earlier, I'm gonna have me a nice little ahi patty. <sighs> Real quick, I've been watching a lot of Survivor. The show is so dope. But I'm gonna actually make a video and try out for Survivor and hopefully get on the show. It's gonna happen. I'm gonna make a video, I'm gonna send it in. I've been studying it, talking to a lot of people, trying to figure out exactly what to do, what to send in. And I think I have a good shot. Now, let's cook the ahi. Here we go. Now it's time to eat my food and watch some Survivor, and then I'll answer you guys' questions. So this is the 3 a.m. challenge. No, it's not. <laughs> Listen, I was about to do the Q&A, but then I remembered that me and Kinsey are going on a little date. So we're going to the bowling ring, or whatever it's called. The bowling alley. Bowling I'm so excited. So we're going to the bowling alley, and we are going to play unlimited bowling until like 1 o'clock in the morning. But we're going to turn it into a little challenge. We're going to see who can win three games first. If you think Kinsey's gonna win, comment down below. Kinsey, if you think I'm gonna win, comment down below Dylan. Also guys, I'm thinking about selling 10 of these shirts, so only 10 people will get them. Can I have one? If you think that's a great idea, no. If you think that's a great idea, then comment down below, yes, sell them. I'm gonna sell 10 of them for 20 bucks a piece. Only 10, you'll be the first 10 people to have a Scump Crew shirt. You jealous, Kinsey? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I forgot to tell you guys that we have the most like dirty rundown bowling alley ever, so the lanes are like, I'm willing to play some money bet right now that the lanes are gonna break down like seven times while we play. 
We're here in the bowling alley now. Time to see who will win, me or Kinsey. We came here late. Kinsey got her information wrong, so we, won't, we might not be able to get six games in, but we're gonna try. I'm just gonna win all three, so that we'll just go home early. No. Breakdown number one for the bowling lane. First play, first breakdown. And then there was one. First one goes to Kinsey. Always. Kinsey won again. Win number two. And that's three wins for Kinsey. 105 to 51. That's game number three. I get taken on another date. That was the worst game of bowling I've ever played in my life. All right, so we just ended the fourth game, and guess who won again? Me! How do you feel about that? I'm and having the and, worst night of bowling ever. And we played double or nothing, so now I get two more dates, and I get to pick. I don't even want to look. All right, guys, so we were right. The bowling lane did break like seven times while we were there. And no, it did it. It only. It did like seven little glitches. The balls kept coming. The pins but kept we coming. Didn't, out. But we didn't have to call anyone. It was a good time. Well, it wasn't that bad. But one of the times the little lane thing came down as I bowled and I hit it, and the lady was giving me a dirty look, and like I was like, it wasn't me. Your lane's just retarded. But Kenzie beat me like seven times. I beat it. He didn't win one game. I'm so good. But. Now let's get to the Q&A. All right guys, we got a lot of questions sent in. Let's just get right into it. These are all names on Instagram. Madison.23. Who's one of your favorite YouTubers? Casey Neistat. I'm underscore not underscore weird 88. Ask me, have I started school yet? I'm out of school. I only went to high school. I didn't go to college. So I just work. Sup.alpha. Do you know any famous YouTubers? I do not know any like famous YouTubers yet. There's a skim competition coming up and Juke Squad's gonna be there. I'm gonna try to get them to do a video with me. YF.NG2 said, would you ever stop doing YouTube? I will never stop YouTube. I might make less videos than before, but I'll never stop just because it's fun and it's really cool to make videos. I really enjoy it. Who inspired you to be a YouTube, to do YouTube? I've always liked videotaping and making funny videos with my friends. So I've had like four YouTube channels in the past, like little ones when I was younger. And then I made Skump Crew, which I started doing edits. And then I saw some people vlogging, like Tanner and Casey Neistat. And I was really like, oh, that's sick. I want to do that. And that's why, that's really what uh, inspired me to start. So pretty much like seeing some vlogging, also really enjoying videotaping in the first place. Next one comes from No Spaces. God is a miracle worker on Instagram. He has a couple questions. How do you feel about the upcoming solar eclipse? It's gonna be dope. There's gonna be a lot of people looking at it and going blind, so there's gonna be a lot of eye doctors making some cash, but don't look at it. It'll burn your retina. Get those little glasses, or there's like videos on how to make those glasses. Make them and look at it. If you were to describe Kinsey in one word, good or bad, what would it be? Um, crazy. I would describe her as crazy. And it's good. It's not a, she, there, it's, that's a good and bad. Like she's good, crazy, like funny, fun, hang around, cool, crazy. And then there's like the crazy Kinsey where it's like, if you don't talk to her in 24 hours, she'll come to your house and like try to cut your head off. And he asked how did me and Kinsey meet? Me and Kinsey met at school, which she would just cheat off me because she sucks at math. E-L-B-Y underscore F-S asked me, how old are you guys? I'm 21. Kinsey's 20. Ryan's about to be 21, Chris is about to be 22, I'm pretty sure. And then the rest of my friends, we're like 20, young 20s. Aaron Moore 52 said, how did you make your t-shirts? Pretty much what I did, I used a thing called a Cricut, cut out this logo, and then used a, a hot, it's like a, not iron, it's like a press made for shirts, a shirt press, pressed it on there. And then this one, I got a little creative with it and just started dripping like bleach all over it and making little dots just cause I think it looks sick. Brock underscore Palmer 05. Who inspired you to be a YouTuber? Like the people that I saw doing it was Tanner Fox, Casey Neistat. Those are the first people I saw doing it. So that's who inspired me. What's your favorite food? Question came from Zach underscore wit underscore that underscore Matt. My favorite food is pizza. I love pizza. I love ramen noodles. I love fish tacos. 
at, at our town, there's this place called the uh, Taco Shop, and they have a thing called the UFO. It's like a burrito, taco, amazing, delicious greatness, and it's a shrimp Baja. A shrimp UFO Baja style is like my favorite thing in the world. Caden underscore Blum 21 asked me, why do you only do stupid stuff? I don't know if this is a good thing or bad thing because like, like people do stupid stuff, but it's funny. I don't know if he likes my videos or if he's making fun of me. I, I, I really don't know. But I do stupid stuff just because it's fun and that's like who I am. I love to do stupid stuff because I'm stupid. Lonely Sniper 10. Why is it called Scump Crew and what inspired you to do YouTube? I already said what inspired me to do YouTube. It's called Scump Crew because we, me and my friends made up the word scump and then we're a crew. So Scump Crew, I just thought it was a funny word. It's really unique. Not a lot of people have that name. So I thought it would be like the perfect YouTube name. The definition of scump, my definition of scump is like good, clean, fun. So that's why it's called the Scump Crew. We just do stuff that we're not going to regret the next day. Good, clean, fun and we're a crew of people. I don't even know how to pronounce this name, guys. I'm so sorry. What was my hardest video to film? Prank videos. Prank videos are hardest to film because you gotta get a camera with a nice lens, and then you gotta set it in a spot where they hopefully won't see it, and then like I can't do the filming, and I'm used to filming everything, so then I gotta get a friend to film, and some of my friends don't wanna film that good, so those are definitely the toughest, because Kinsey ends up filming, and she's like shaking, or like doesn't stabilize it, or doesn't focus in at the right time, and just, Def those are definitely the hardest to film. There's one more from Aaron Moore 52 He said, how is it driving long distances? And honestly, I don't care because I have Kinsey drive all of them. If you look in every single video, Kinsey's always driving. She drives me. And I thank you so much for that, Kinsey. Thank you for doing that. You're such a sweet girlfriend. And I pretty much just relax, watch. Uh, I, I get a TV show on my laptop, watch that, do some social media stuff, like post some posts do some videotaping. I just try to do stuff the whole time or just take a nap while Kenzie's driving. <laughs> Thank you guys for all the questions. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. I hit the subscribe button down there. Hit the like button. Show me you appreciate this video. Peace out guys. Stay scumpy and do stuff that's fun.